This is a paradise where we watch for happiness and harvest joyfulness. It is located in southeast China on the west bank of the Taiwan Strait. It has a high mountain, long river, broad sea, and beautiful island. This is a world geological park. Mountains, seas, rivers, and islands crisscross like a chessboard. The faraway mountains and nearby waters and the azure sky and the blue sea lie between the Fujian Eastern Mountains and the Gold Coast. Ageless with natural elegance, dozens of timber-arched corridor bridges carry thousands of years of history. Situated in the east foothills of the middle Jufang Mountains, Zhendan Buddhist Jitai Mountain is the origin of Huayan Buddhism. This is the backland of the Chinese Shu. Through hundreds of years, the folk custom here still remains original and mellow. The joy of mountains and water and the regimen for preserving a healthy life have given birth to the Eastern Fujian tea culture featured by unique lingering tea charm and taste. This is a must tourist attraction. Let's enter the Mountain Sea Grand View Garden. A shallow bay, two streams, three huge rocks surrounded by mountains. Walking in Bai Shiyan, you can reach all you see and see all you dream of. The Bai Shuihu waterfall is like a huge water slide. You can flow with the water and cruise in it escaping from high-rises behind and noises afar. Joyfulness comes all of a sudden, almost in a second. Playing in it, your joy will become a part of the most beautiful scenery. The flow of water sprays, a thousand flowers blossom. The flowing water created the impressive canyon in Bayun Mountain. In the thousands of years of ebb and flow, the beauty of everything is etched in stone. These solid rocks were carved into flowers. Every petal has a story. Time is like water. In the occasional hiking, you can hear the echo from the open field. You watch the faraway morning glow and sunset and discover your long aspiration for mountains. There are no ugly rocks in Tiamu Mountain. Every rock is like art from heaven. Mountains originally exist in one's life. In the mountain, there must be a gift for the guest from afar who is waiting for consolation. Yushan Island, facing Tiamu Mountain across the sea, is named one of the top 10 most beautiful sea islands in China. On the island, Tianhu Lake is ever clear and encircled by mountains. The surrounding 10,000 mu grassland sends out its fragrance making people feel as if they are in Mount Tianshan in northern China. In the sunshine, we enjoy the greenery and sweet fragrance. In the fog, we appreciate the boundless sky and fields. In the early morning, we watch water birds flying low and hear the weeds dancing vigorously. In the dawn, we play among the green grass in the slope and realize that happiness can be so simple.
a shallow bay, tranquil beauty, casual beauty. The sea is connected with the shoreside, composing the harmony between dots and lines. The boat reflects the nets, emitting the saturation between light and shadows. Through the camera lens of the heart, scenery and beauty are amplified. Listening to the ebb and flow by the thousand miles of coast, watch the life and growth of a hundred thousand mudflats. There is a red maple forest on the mountain. There is an ancient Banyan's woodlot beside the forest. The world's northernmost ancient Banyan's woodlot and world's southernmost natural maple forest are all located in Yangjiaxi. be with you in this life and the next life once again. Every stream here runs the promise of love. Every inverted image here projects the poem of love. Built by mountain, live by water, watch time flow away with the stream. Water flows never endlessly in this annual ring. The bridge stands peacefully on it. What flows away is time. What remains are stories. The Gallery Bridge in Ningda recorded stories in China's bridge-building history. It combines bridge, corridor, pavilion, and temple. No nails, no irons. It is connected only by the mortise and tenon joint of timbers, which is second to none in the world's bridge-building history. Year after year, the bridge shares with people the serenity in ordinary and ferry safety into people's lives. This is another tea harvest season. The tea aroma beautifies every tea leaf. In the morning with silk rain and sunshine, the tea garden sends out an unworldly appeal. Fuding is the hometown of Chinese white tea. Protogenic tea leaves, traditional and fine crafts granted with a charming and tranquil nature. The Tanyang Gongfu Black Tea of Fuan was awarded the Gold Prize in the Panama World's Fair in 1915, together with Mao Tai, and enjoys a world reputation. In the early Song Dynasty, villagers of Zhaoning Fuyuan cultivated carp in the stream to keep the drinking water safe. They made a regulation that no angling or catching was allowed, and everyone must get along with the fish harmoniously. People chanted sutras and a funeral oration for dead fish. For 800 years, people and fish lived together harmoniously, which later became the story of loving and protecting the fish and was incorporated into the Guinness World Book of Records. If I were a carefree fish, I must be the happiest fish in the world because I would live and grow in this winding stream and form firm ties with the people alongside it and swim for 800 years worry-free in the clean and clear water. If I were a person living beside the stream, I must be the happiest man in the world because I would form firm ties with the fish in the stream and accompany each other life after life happily beside this clean and clear stream for 800 years.
Kinda is a good place to watch for happiness and harvest joyfulness. This is the mood when you're looking out from on top of Dongsha Mountain and ask for directions to preserve your health. This is a wonder among clouds over Tsuiping Lake whose green wave is like a mirror. This is a touch by visiting the revolution history of East Ming. This is a holy land discovered by heart and harmonious beauty. This is a must-see tourist attraction. Welcome to Ningda.